Hello, everyone. Welcome back to my channel. <coughs> Excuse me. My name is Becky. I'm Becky Selman's Art Studio. How's everybody doing? Today, I'm going to be doing a ribbon pour. Yay. And I want to do this after a... This lady, she's a beautiful woman, um, Antonia Dente, I'm sorry if I butchered your name, I'm not good with names, um, but she did a ribbon pour in these colors, I think, and oh my goodness, so I'm going to try to recreate, or try to not recreate, um, I, I, I'm going to try to recreate. Of course, you know, recreation is a, the best form of flattery. So, I loved this, these, this color scheme and her idea of the ribbon. So, I've got these colors. I've got my titanium white. It's all mixed with mix. 7-1. My white. Uh, the, these colors have been sitting for a little while. So... They might have thickened up, which I kind of wanted the white to thicken, so that way my ribbons won't spread, I'm hoping. Um, and then I've got some more white, but I've added a little water to it to thin it down to kind of give me a little bit of a, if I need a little bit of a, a flow extender. So, I've got my white, and I've got flow extender, just in case. It's just an in case. Then I've got burnt umber. I do believe this is burnt umber. Right here. Then we have Fuchsia by Global Colors. And these are all Global Colors. Uh, yeah, the Burnt Umber is Global Colors. The Fuchsia is Global Colors. This is one of the... Uh, the 250 milliliter bottles of Global Colors. This is Watermelon, and this is a gorgeous color. Gorgeous. It is an opaque. These are all opaque colors, so I'm hoping I won't lose any of these colors. Then I have the 24 the 24K Gold um, by Deco Art. It is mixed a little thinner, so I'm hoping that I can get some cells to pop up. I'm not sure. We're going to try. This might turn out to be a mess, but I'm hoping that this is going to work. So I've got my canvas taped. And sprayed the back to make it drum tight and so here we are we're gonna pour oh that might be a little too thick I didn't we're gonna try it though We're going to try. It's not really moving. So, <laughs> I think we've already kind of messed up. So, I'm going to kind of move it a little bit. It is thick. Thick, 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 thick. So I am using a wooden stick and I really didn't want to, but this is kind of what I had uh, in a pinch, you know, kind of use what you got. And I've just kind of semi messed that up. So I'm going to try to tilt that back out. Hopefully... I can get this to work. Okay. So I don't think I'm going to spin it. I think I'm just going to pick it up and tilt it. So I've got a pretty good puddle. Whew. Okay. I'm going to pop bubbles. I don't want a whole lot of white to come through. So I'm popping bubbles. I don't want the white to come through. Now I've got to layer a cup. <laughs> I've got to go get a cup. Oh, shoot. I'll be right back. Okay, I think I always. 
always do this and I always forget something or other. So, and that was me stubbing my toe earlier. So, you know, this is just me. So, we're going to start this. We're going to pour. Pink. And I'm just going to layer. I'm going to mix that gold up a little bit. There we go. Just kind of get them that layer off top. I hope all y'all can still see what I'm doing. Got my pink in the cup. And I'm going to pour the watermelon. For the brown. I'm going to add a bit of the gold. I don't think I should have added the gold. Oh, man. It's okay. I'll just add the ribbons across those dots. And maybe I shouldn't be pouring it over that. But it'll be okay. I could at least scrape the sides of my cup. Please forgive me if I butchered up this process. Okay. I think I got my cup layered enough. Add just a little bit more. Okay. Whoops. Dripping, dripping, dripping. Okay. So I've got my cup layered. Just added some gold on the bottom. Okay, so here we go. So she says to let it sit for a minute, so I'm going to let it sit. Hoping I could get some cells to pop up through those. There is no silicone or any oil in my cell. There's no cell tastic. There's nothing in my colors except mix. Oh, I think I added too much in the cup. That's okay because I can make another one. Or I can at least make some coasters. So now, here we go. I didn't quite hit 
the gold mark. Okay, so we'll add me a little flow extender around the edge because I'm going to need it. It's going to have to come off that edge. gonna have to come off the edge so let me pour this on I'm hoping I can get this pour to okay now we're gonna we're gonna tilt it out and see if I can't get this open I gotta get these corners to come over there we go now we're gonna come down this way tilt over that way over that corner come down there we go. Come back this way. We're going to take it to this corner. Now, hopefully. When I get this tilted out, it'll be nice, decent enough. I'm going to tilt all of that. There we go. Then we'll bring it back. I didn't mean to put that much gold on it, but... I gotta bring that paint back to center. Okay. Okay, so <laughs> I'm not the master of lines. That's Miss Antonia. But, I tried my best. Now I'm going to kind of... Uh, don't see. <laughs> yeah. Um... I like it. Maybe some more sales will come up, but you know, there's some popping. There's some coming through. I mean, I can't be, I can't be too mad about it. It's my first ribbon pour. I definitely do need, I definitely do see, um, that maybe the paint needs to be thinner than thicker. So that way it rolls a little bit, it slides a little better. 
to the corners without, you know, dragging. But I'm, I'm not, I'm not too incredibly upset about it. So, I might could even wreck it a little bit. Let's see. I still got a whole lot of paint on there. And I could wreck it in spots, you know. Through the gold just you know lightly to give it some some like white arches like that to make it look kind of I need this one to go this way. So we'll drag it through like that. We won't make this one near as long. There we go. So, I'm going to bring y'all down for a close-up. made really pretty colors and that gold underneath not through the other colors it's going to put a shimmer and then that those colors that don't have gold it's going to be very pretty anyway i hope y'all enjoyed this uh experiment and i hope you enjoyed it antonia uh and i and I hope that I did not do you wrong in the making of this because I really enjoy watching you pour your ribbons. They're so much better than this one. Uh, so, but anyway, if you enjoyed this video, please like, share, and subscribe. And I will see you in the next video. Thanks. Bye.